Come on, man. Come on, man. Roll that beautiful bean footy. Why is okay. that cheating Here on I am camera? Right now. She's up here parked with this guy in this truck. Um, cheating on me. So let's go pull up in here and see what they have to say for themselves. Yeah. They're over here cheating on me right now in this truck. And here they are, right here. Huh? Uh, I'm showing you're cheating on me. Huh? No. This is proof right here. She's cheating on me right now with this guy. I, su I subpoenaed I subpoenaed your uh, texts and your phone records too. Huh? You don't have a PFA on me. I can drive by your house. No, it's not. Yeah, here we go. Yeah. Bye. See you later. I'm gonna call the police. I'm gonna send. I'm gonna go show the kids this too. What up, people? It's your boy, the host with the most. I do not brag or boast. I'm coming to you live, coast to coast. It yeah, boy. I'm Chris the Dom One. Please be sure to hit that subscription button, the notification bell, like, share this video with your friends, family, as well as your followers. But anyway, nevertheless, I'm the best. Let's tackle and address this video, okay? So I was, you know, searching the interwebs and I found and I ran across this video about cheaters, all right? So apparently, after watching the footage, there were so many things in this video that I have to unleash for you guys, okay? Now, I don't know if the video is factual or not, but we're gonna treat this video as it, a factual video. So exhibit A, one thing I noticed about this video after watching this video is this guy has no driving skills whatsoever, okay? This fool is doing a 30, He's doing 60 and a 30, all right? This this guy has no driving skill. And there was a couple of times the camera was shaking because, sir, you was running through gravel, okay? Now, here's the street. There's the intersection. Here's all this gravel, okay? You're just running all in the gravel. I don't know if you're puzzled and confused. I don't know if you're still mad, you're hypertensioning. I don't know what is going on with you. But that's the one thing I noticed about this video. Another thing I noticed about this video is how he pulled up, okay? His pull-up skills was is not that impressive, okay? This man wasn't Dale Earnhardt Jr., okay? Uh, and the way how he pulled up, you can tell the wife and her secret lover knew he was pulling up and they were still doing their thing thing. They they didn't give they didn't give a damn. They didn't try to jump out the truck like, what are you doing? Why are you way out here? Uh it's some lovely weather out here. Don't you agree, husband? You know, something like that. They just continued to do their thing thing. So another thing I noticed about this video, sir, you are not a good video taker, okay? Yo, if you have a, a diploma in videography sir that's not you okay what school did you go to to get that videotaping skill because let me tell you something the wife was out of focus we couldn't even get a clean shot of your wife okay all i know is i saw some legs maybe maybe she, was, she had some shorts on but i couldn't tell her face because her face was blurted out all right so you need to address your videos, your video taking skills, okay? You need to address first of all your driving skills, your PI, okay, private investigator skills, okay. Another thing you need to notice, another thing you need to address is your camera skills, because everyone was out of focus, okay? Your wife was just a huge blur. And to make matters even worse, okay, why did you, you turn on the light on your camera? Excuse me, well, we can see 
the person that your wife is cheating on. All right, we, we don't even know what this guy looked like. All we can go is by his voice, okay? We don't know his look. We don't even know, uh, you know, his nationality. Like that really even matters whether or not is he white, black, Chinese, Puerto Rican. We, we just don't know, all right? But it would have been helpful for us to know, all right? And another thing I know is about this video as well, sir, all right? Your wife wasn't that alertive. Your wife really didn't even care. The ability of two dead flies. She didn't really care you busted her, okay? And I know a lot of people are not gonna pay attention with this video, but I noticed it myself, sir. When you busted her red-handed, the first thing that uttered out of her mouth was not the fact that, oh, you caught me, oh, I'm sorry, allow your allow your girlfriend slash wife slash uh baby mama to explain what is going on now <laughs> you think this is cheating this is, has nothing to do with cheating okay honey i was here on an interview all right he's interviewing me for a potential job that i am seeking okay well, what type of job you are seeking whores or us okay we don't know what is going on all right but the one thing I did notice in that video, sir, is it wasn't the fact that it was total denial on her part. It's the fact that she wanted you to come to her, all right? What are you doing? Come here. Come here. Let me explain it to you. Come here. Like, you couldn't explain it to him like 10 feet away from him. He had to come to you to explain. Because I know what she was trying to do. She was going to try to convince you. She was going to she was going to zombify you. She was going to control your mind, red pill, red pill, blue pill, that type of goddamn skill to get you to just simply just agree on her cheating. Okay, like she's not cheating on you. You cheating on her. Huh? Come again? She's not cheating on you, sir. You cheating on her, all right? Because you didn't bring the necessary qualifications to make her happy, all right? Now, don't get me wrong. I don't like judging people, but the the boyfriend, husband, whatever you are to this lady, I can tell that, you know, you probably got this girl because basically you've given her everything she wanted. The sun, the moon, the stars, okay? She was putting some mad whip appeal on you, okay? And you just gave her anything. If she wanted a smartphone, you bought her a smartphone. If she wanted her own car, you gave her a car. You wanted, if she wanted her own bank account, you gave her her own bank account, okay? It was just that easy for her. And the, thing, the funny thing about relationships are when your significant other can easily get things without working hard for them, without going to school and learning a trade. Uh, you know, when you take the when you take the ability and the phase of you have to earn what you want, all right, then everything is quite easy for her to get. And if everything is so easy for her to get, uh, she's not going to respect that. Everything in this girl's life was given to her. And that's probably why she has no uh, respect for you, my friend, my good sir. She, she doesn't have any type of respect for you. Therefore, uh, she figured, well, I can just, if I get caught, I can just talk my way out of this situation, okay? Frank is going to believe anything that comes out of my mouth, okay? Uh, Henry Philip, uh, I don't know your name, sir, but I guarantee you, I guarantee you people out there, this is probably what went down and probably what went out. He busted her, okay? Red-handed, all right? She tried to explain herself, tried to get herself out of that situation, all right? He didn't have no dealings with it. I guarantee you a day, a week goes by, they're back together again. They're back together again. Why? Because that's probably the hottest woman he has ever been aligned with, okay? And anything else is going to be below average. And two, she always talked her way in and out of situations, all right? She's going to just say, oh, she, she was wrong. I'm sorry. I didn't mean to cheat on you. He's going to accept her with open arms, and then they're going to be back husband or wife or girlfriend or boyfriend 
until the next time she cheats on her. And then when the next time she cheats on her, cheats on him, he's gonna, she's gonna do the same exact thing, okay? Copy and paste, just copy and paste, all right? So yeah, I saw this video and I could not believe what I saw from this video, but I got a sneaking suspicion they still go together. It's no big deal to them, okay? But if y'all like this video, please comment in the comment section. Also, tell me what would you do in that situation? Instead of just saying, oh, I would have just left her. You know, I would just pack my stuff up and go. Here's another thing I know about this video before we end this. He's up there talking about, I'm gonna show, I'm gonna show this video to our family. How dare you? I'm gonna show this video to my kids, my co-workers. I'm gonna show this video to everyone, the police department. I'm gonna show this video to everybody to embarrass you, okay? Generally, when people talk that way, generally, they do not want this relationship to end, okay? Uh, because anyone else in those situations, and if they got something better, or if they believe they have something better, they'll just simply move on. I'm gonna have to leave you alone, pack your bags, and get the hell on. Has the wherewithal to just say, hey, I'm not gonna chase her, I'm just gonna simply replace her. That type of mentality, or I can do damn by myself, okay? People like that generally just exit stage left that relationship and simply move on. I'm Chris the Don One. I will come back with another video. Deuces.